how I make my um, like breakfast sandwiches that are vegan and gluten free. So I showed you all the ingredients of like everything. It's all like packaged stuff. This is not like a healthy thing by any means. So please don't think that it is. But I'm taking some earth balanced butter and for these brown rice English muffins, because they're gluten free, I found that if I put them in the toaster oven, they get like rock hard and then like you can barely eat them. So I just uh, put them in the microwave for a minute and that's how they like stay soft. They're not like crispy like they would be in like the toaster, but for me it's really good um, and I don't mind it. So I just put butter like on both sides and then on one of the sides, I put this like um, aioli. This stuff's pretty good. Uh, I think I got this from Whole Foods. And so then I just put the aioli on one side. And you guys, this is the best breakfast sandwich like you'll ever have if you're if you're vegan and gluten free. To clean up as I go. Ooh, you know what? I think I might put some Tabasco sauce on it today because I haven't had any hot sauce in a while. Okay, the next thing I do is I take this just egg and chow cheese and the just egg is like the folded ones. It comes like this, nothing eco-friendly about this, but I'm in survival mode right now that I'm like gluten-free and I just need things that I can eat that taste good to me. So how I make this and what I found tastes the best, this is what it looks like, <laughs> kind of crazy, right? Um, and I'll take our chow cheese open that up um, and then I'll just take a slice of this cheese and I'll just stick it on top like this and put it in the toaster oven and then I just let that toast this packaging is also um, a lot more eco-friendly because when you open it up it there's no like plastic or anything which is pretty cool so I just take one of these and put it on the frying pan. You don't want to put this in your toaster because there's a lot of oil on it and the oil will drip and it'll smoke your whole house out and most likely set off the fire alarm, which is what I've done. So do it in the pan. You kind of like use all of your appliances, the microwave, the toaster, and the stove for this little English muffin meal. But I promise you it's the best way to do it and it's really good. So. That's on there cooking. You don't have to put anything in the pan. Just put it in with nothing. Um, this is getting a little cold. I probably should have done this part last, but you know, we live and we learn. And then I'm gonna have my little Tabasco with it and we'll enjoy breakfast together. Okay guys, now for the taste test. I don't know why I'm shaking this, it doesn't need to be shaken. By the way, you guys know how like I'm very passionate about being eco-friendly. Buying these bot these plastic bottles kill me on the inside. Um, but right now with like all my health stuff going on, this is like the one thing that keeps me feeling from like I'm gonna pass out or get like super dizzy. I just constantly drink these throughout the day um, because it's got like salt and like all these things. And I've tried like the more natural, um, like I was drinking Gatorade, but that one wasn't really making me feel that great. I tried like the IV liquid. I tried the Replenisha or like, I don't know. There's like a bunch of other ones that are basically supposed to be like electrolyte drinks. Either didn't really didn't like them or they didn't really do anything for me. So that's why I'm, I was hoping that like I could buy them in bigger bottles or have like some sort of like a powder. You know how Gatorade has like the powder where you can make it so you don't have to buy in the bottles. Um, they don't have that. And it's like, it's from Whole Foods. So like it's not cheap. And anyway, I'm glad that it's not, I found something though that makes me feel better. Okay, here we go. Mm. Oh well. I think this is the best thing for him because it has like vitamins and minerals. Okay. 
I signed your um your appearance release uh thing on your behalf by the way for the documentary. Okay. They sent it over to my email for DocuSign. As my wife, you have approval to do those kinds of things. Thank you. Or take me off life support if I break a finger or something. Doc, his finger is broken. I can't see him like this. Pull the plug. Ma'am, your husband is perfectly fine. He's, he's just going to be a couple weeks till it's fixed. I can't, I can't bear him to be like that. Pull the plug. Mm -hmm. uh, Ma'am, there's no plug to pull. Mm. I kind of like it without the extra bread piece. So just kind of eating it like open face is what I prefer. Mm. So good. I'm gonna try it with some hot sauce this time. See how they like it with the hot sauce. Mm. It's really good, it just adds a lot more flavor. This is like my new favorite thing right now. Since I had to go gluten free, I've been eating this like every day. <laughs> Cause it's just like very filling and it like makes doesn't make me feel bad and it's really good there's some random stuff on our table right now It's even good without the sausage. Like you could just eat it with like an egg and cheese. That's good too. Mmm. It gets so cold after I eat. That's really spicy. Yeah. I'm gonna put this in the microwave and save it for later. Don't you have to put the little stethoscope in your ears, baby, so you could hear his heart? Yeah. He wants medicine. He needs some medicine? Okay. He needs some medicine. All right, Dr. Snow, I'll get it. Get it. I'll get it for you. Are these your other patients? He wants mess him. Okay. Hmm. Even knowing it let go. Add color into yourself. Now lights like a movie, camera pose. One time for the girl, Shannon Rose.